Let's go ahead and talk about the color box and the, uh, the other color tools here. Uh, we, uh, we went over the color box here. You basically pick your colors. The color inspector and color box work hand in hand. So as you adjust this, you can see the parameters in the color inspector also change. And if you were to change the parameters in the color inspector, it will also change. Uh, it will also adjust itself in the color box. So they work hand in hand. If I were to pick a color, let's see tools. As you can see, it changes in the color inspector, and it will also change in the color box. Okay, uh, in your color palette, you have the option to add a color or remove a color. So let's remove one and you can add it. And let's add some more. Okay, I brought up a picture. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the color editor in Pencil 2D. And they have an option for uh, pick screen color. So not only does it pick a color from uh, the Pencil 2D program, but you can also pick colors whatever is on that screen. Over here, I got a color for green, uh, purple, magenta, so I could basically pick any of these colors. So again, all you have to do is select that button, pick screen color, and it can choose any color that's on your screen. But that's basically it for this tutorial. Uh, if you enjoyed it, leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you want more of these tutorials. This is DJS Animation 100 signing out. Thanks for watching.